Good morning from beautiful Lake Tawakany. This is going to be bass champs. It's uh, 5.47. We could leave the ramp at 5. We left the ramp at 5. And we ran to our first spot where we wanted to start, and somebody was already there. I'm not sure how they got there that quick, but they were. So we are opting to plan B and hoping we get a little bit of breeze so we don't burst into flames today. So stick around and hopefully we're going to show you all some fish catches here from Lake Tawakany as the sun comes up. It's going to be a Texas summer day, boys. Frog. <laughs> Good job, dude. Oh, a freaking frog. Oh, hooked on the outside of the face. Sorry about that, brother. I did not want to hurt you. That's a. Uh, I'm going to pull down right here, right? Straight up lucky right there. Oh, shit. I just filled the hole full of water. Two and three, bang, bang. Plan B ain't going bad right now. Plan B. Oops. 
Suckers got some bad gun. They got some power to them. Though. They're Tawaki fish. They're mad about living here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, they true. are. They're yeah. like, oh, I can't believe I got stuck here in the great draw. <laughs> Good one. I don't know if that's where you want that net. So it took us 46 minutes to catch our limit. That's way better than I had thought it would be. Especially when we had to opt to plan B, but that's a solid two and three quarter pound fish. We got a little bit of weight pretty early in the day. We can just keep it up. in there to catch him. Well, I broke the spider web and then I threw in there again and then I threw it in there beside it. Third chance of charm. Yeah. All right guys so uh, another uh, another tournament in the books. You guys saw I mean what we did we did fast so uh, we started on a main lake spot uh, just something that we actually as we said in the start of the video we tried to go to our first spot and there was somebody there went to our second spot and uh, this is what happened, and it happened really fast. Ken Smith, Terry Hawkins, our Spark Energy team. And then we spent the rest of the day trying that stuff. We tried flipping bushes, we tried flipping docks, and we caught fish off and on all day, but I think we had a one ounce cull after eight o'clock this morning. So just never really happened for us. It looks like we're gonna finish 12th, which we're happy with. I mean, we'd love to have done better, but two 26 pound stringers are pretty stout over here. Yeah, so. yeah. Hey, you know, I've been wondering about something. What's that? Where do you get that custom Phoenix visor? Man, the only thing that sucks about Phoenix is they don't make a visor, so I had to make myself a, a visor. So, uh, anyway, that's what we got. So. That's awesome. But. So, I wanted to show you guys. So, uh, we talked last time, and you saw today, Terry caught several again on that biffle bug or a uh, biffle bug bait. But he's using, sorry, I know that was probably a bad camera angle, but he's using a, a uh, what's the name of this tackle company? It's an all terrain swing head. And what it does, it allows you to put your own hook on it, which uh, I use this uh, finesse hook. It's a hyper, hyper shape uh, Mike McClellan hook. It's a five aught. It's a hybrid worm hook. And uh, what it does, it allows you to use a bigger hook than the, you know, the biffle bug. Show how it fastens to the. To and then the it just comes on there. So yeah, you just. Do you like don't ever have one come unbuttoned. No, I never had one come unbuttoned and snap it back on it allows the hook to sit back in the bait um, and it's actually more <clears> free moving <throat> than even a biffle bug is a hard yeah biffle bug. yeah yeah and it's slick and there's your little stopper yeah I leave that bobber stopper on there protect the knot and you can go to a, you can go to like a six aught and put a a big bite fighting frog it it sets back a little bigger so if you want to 
you know, throw something different, you can get that fighting frog and put it on there, and then the six odd will even get your hook, you know, further back. Yeah, that is, so that is really slick. Yeah. Thanks, Terry. Just something else I need to go spend money on. <laughs> and you can get them at a tackle warehouse or or Fun and Son has. If you want to see them in person, Fun and Son carries all terrain tackle. So. That's his honey saying. How much money do we win, baby? All right, guys, so that's it. I just wanted to show you all that because that's cool. That was something that we talked about last time at Chambers, and I really didn't take a good look at it. So thanks for sharing. You bet. All right, man. All Enjoyed right. it. Thank you. We'll see you later. All right, we'll see you. See you guys. We'll have more up for you later this week. Thanks.